Hello everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for December 23rd, 2021. AngelSouls444.com for personal readings, gumroad.com slash angelsouls for archangel videos including how to connect with angels and how to have an angel encounter. All right, let's see what we have going on today. Lots of changes, lots of development, lots of soul contract stuff coming up, okay? <laughs> Be ready for it. Let's see. Oh, Lord. Okay, that was me just getting sloppy with the cards. You know how it goes. <laughs> All, right. All right. We have... Okay. Do I have the deck upside down? I had the deck upside down. How about that? Cool, right? All right. Last quarter moon in Aquarius. Reflect on your priorities. Again, bringing the emotional state back into it. We have been taught to basically deny our purest power, which is our empathy. That is our strength. And yet it has been so diminished. It has been pushed aside. We honor people who have no empathy. We allow them to be leaders, okay? And this is saying enough of that. Like, no, you focus on your priorities. If enough of us bring our empathy into our situation, we start caring about one another. We won't be capable of harming each other because your pain is my pain, right? So we're going to start seeing a, a, a very big shift towards peace, really, if we, if we honor that within ourselves. Now, this is going to be diminished. It's going to be, you're going to be seen as weak. You're going to be seen as too sensitive. You're going to see all that uh, coming at you. But if you don't tolerate it and you understand that your empathy is your strength and that we should be caring about one another and stop doing this thing of, oh, let them go be somebody else's problem, hopefully... That won't be coming at you. Maybe it'll happen to someone else. Never wish bad upon someone else because we are all one. We are all connected. And what you do to another is just going to come back to you, right? So really, um, yeah. Again, I feel like I feel like some people are getting so overwhelmed with this because it says focus on your priorities that I think maybe you get up in the morning instead of hitting the ground running, trying to take care of like, you know, the holiday shopping and getting stuff for the meal or whatever you do around this time of year, instead of doing that, maybe you get up and you decide to practice piano because that you're learning piano or you get up and practice singing or you do a little reading. Do something for you because prioritizing your joy is what sets you up to be able to do other things, right? So instead of short-circuiting because you're getting so stressed, you can you know start the day off in a high frequency and let things flow. Okay, so I think that's a big message for today as well. So we're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.